Four people, including the attacker and a police officer, were killed and 40 injured in what has been described as the deadliest London terror attack in 12 years. During a town hall meeting in Pebush yesterday, Prime Minister Roosevelt Skerritt first expressed his sympathy at what he referred to as a senseless attack. Let me, let me first of all, on behalf of the government and people of Dominica, extend our solidarity with the government and people of the United Kingdom on the senseless act against the British people which took place today. And to extend our sympathies and prayers to those, to the families of those whose lives were taken away from them. And Skerritt assured that the people of Dominica will be in solidarity with every nation across the world fighting against terrorism, as terrorism anywhere is a threat to people everywhere. Uh, Dominica stands, as we have been doing, to work with nations across the world to fight terrorism of any form. Because with the presence of terrorism, it is creating a very uncertain and unstable world for all of us. And all of us will suffer the consequences of that. Eight people have since been arrested in light of the incident, and ISIS has claimed responsibility for the attack. In the attack on Wednesday afternoon, a man drove a car along a pavement in Westmin's, on Westminster Bridge, knocking down pedestrians, creating panic and leaving dozens injured. He then ran towards Parliament where he stabbed PC Palmer, who was unarmed. Armed police then shot dead the attacker on the grounds.